Let's go, let's go, let's go, man. So 2K had a, a, an earnings call recently, Visual Concept, which owns 2K. They recently talked about how successful WWE 2K22 was for them. And they have confirmed in that same exact meeting that WWE 2K23 is in development and will come out within the 2023 fiscal year now what that means is that it can release between october 2022 to september 2023 this is outstanding news man 2k22 looked beautiful ran beautiful for the most part and it did have its fair share of glitches and things we all can complain about no doubt about it but it is one of the most highly rated wwe games that 2k has done and it's one of the best wrestling games that has come out in a long time in my opinion so the fact that they're gonna continue developing the game going forward for the foreseeable future it is phenomenal news now i did see the same video all of you guys have been sending me by smack talks so credit to smack talks for reporting this online and talking about what happened within that meeting now it's also being reported that not only was 2k22 extremely successful financially it exceeded their expectations so all of that is music to my ears i am one of those on here that have been super supportive of 2k and what they've done with 2k22 so i am really excited to see how the game improves going forward. There's a lot of unfinished business with my GM, Universe Mode, the Creation Suite. I'm just excited to see what else they have to offer. You know what I mean? To me, this is good news. I know a lot of you guys are gonna be like, oh my God, no way. What are they doing? Why are they still gonna be making those WWE games? I don't want them to continue making the WWE games, but Look, man, I am extremely hyped. Obviously, I like I'm tr I'm trying to process this information because I just found out and I just I was like I gotta make a video, I gotta react, I gotta talk about it because 2K22 was just so much fun and it still is so much fun and there's still so much DLC and, and things to look forward to. Now it wasn't all that perfect. My excitement it, it is not because the game was flawless. All right. The game has its flaws and it has its fair share of issues, but it doesn't mean that the game is garbage or that they should stop making them going forward. All right. I just wanted to put this out there. Wanted to have a reason to talk about 2K23 already, man. We already have 2K23 to look forward to and talk about for the you know coming months and we're only in May. 2K22 just dropped in March, and it's it's great that it did so well and that so many people have played it across all platforms. So can't wait to see what comes next for uh, 2K Games and WWE. Now, we don't know how long the, the contract is for. They were very vague as to the information they provided. They just said that they're looking forward to their partnership with WWE and 2K going forward with this franchise. But it, it doesn't mean that it's going to be for like the next 10 years or whatever the case is. We really, truly don't know. Um, but look at Seth Rollins, guys. How can you hate this game when they got the the Monday Night Messiah, Seth freaking Rollins? <laughs> so, yeah, guys, you know, I always say this. I'm interested in seeing what you guys have to say about it. It's obviously a, a something to look forward to and, and something to talk about here on stream and on video as well so look forward to more wwe content even more 2k games because 2k23 is currently in development i'll see y'all later thank you for tuning in peace